Hi, my name is Van James. I'm a teaching artist from Hawaii, and I would like to introduce a series of painting videos, painting exercises for teachers who work with students in grades one through 12. Look for a separate video on supplies, the materials you'll need to start these lessons. And once you're prepared with that, let's get started. I'd like to have us do a third grade painting today. We'll be using watercolor and we will use the wet on wet technique whereby we need to wet down the paper on one side, flip it over, and wet down the other side. We want to get all the air bubbles out, have the paper nice and flat, and not have it swimming with water. It should just be moist. Moist so that when the color touches it, it bleeds just slightly. Yeah, making the forms loose. Loose and free. We'll only need three colors today. The first will be lemon yellow. The second will be Prussian blue. And then the vermilion red. We'll follow that then with the Prussian blue again. So let's apply the lemon yellow nice and smoothly. This radiant color, this color that, that really sings with brightness. We want to bring that onto the page from the heavens flowing downward. And have a ray of light streaming down from it. And a second one. Now make those into nice golden blades penetrating into the whiteness of the snowy page. We then rinse our brush. We always want to rinse the brush very well, having two jars of water, one that gets very dirty, the other that stays clean. And then we'll take the Prussian blue. We'll bring that flowing onto the page below the lemon yellow. Whenever the sun's light penetrates the snowy winter fields, it will eventually melt the snow and the water will flow. And here we have the blue flowing around, streaming into the edges of the yellow. We take all of the white away from the page and we now have two color contrast, lemon yellow and Prussian blue. And then we go on to our third color, the warm vermilion red, and we plant a seed of this warm color down in the bottom, right at the point of this blade of light in the yellow. We plant this seed of vermilion red and let it spark up, let it as this spark of red flame up into the shaft of yellow. Turning this very active orange red. Children love to do this kind of painting where, uh, where a life is taking place in the colors conversation, an inner activity. We let this red come up and round itself at the top 
it's striving upwards striving upwards towards the airy light of the lemon yellow above takes all that yellow out down below reaching down pointing towards the blue and then if the children haven't already guessed what they're painting and this is one of the things that is so key to the excitement in painting is to have the anticipation not telling the children oh we're painting such and such today but that we're painting colors we're painting the elements And then we take the Prussian blue and we just sprinkle this Prussian blue in its watery way up above. It turns green on the lemon yellow. And we've then, we've turned the painting into carrots. Yes, we've worked with our magic wand out of the all of the elements to create these living plants, the carrots. I hope you enjoyed this painting exercise and found some ideas for how you can develop your own further. Remember to not just observe them, but actually do the painting exercises because you learn so much more through the hand-eye intelligence that you gather from the work. Uh, if you want more resources, look into my book, Painting with Hand, Head, and Heart. And keep painting. Aloha, ahui ho.